Welcome to Happy Chthonian. I'm Christoph, and this is a normal way to do one of these videos. Uh, today, I'm going to walk you through how to do uh, character creation with my All Dice Space Truckers Character Creator Zine. All right, uh, and I'll put links to where you can get this, baby. It's pay what you want. If you want to pay zero, then go ahead. I, you know, every little penny my way just helps me uh, make more stuff. So. Without further ado, for this, you're going to need your standard role-playing or adventure game dice, the 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, and 20-sided dies. Dies? Dice? Got mine arranged here. And we'll make two characters. One will roll the dice one at a time, and one will roll the whole fist full of dice. Uh, these are the four archetypes that there is. Mercenary, Android, Scientist, and Pilot. Let's crack her open. I'll show you what I'm talking about here. It's the center spread, naturally. So, instructions are pretty straightforward. Roll once per table on these pages, and then once per table on a, another set of pages that are color cold, coded according to your archetype. Shows you little images of the die type. We'll start with a D4. So our character is going to be a mercenary, and their mercenary gear is an automatic rifle. All right, next is a D12, which is their coping mechanism, because I, of course, have a bleak kind of uh, idea of what our future is going to look like. This is a grungy c CRT, you know, uh, tube TV kind of 1980s sci-fi. So the, the mercenary needs to cope with a harmonica. He's playing blues traveler up in space. And he's got also some more gear. Number 11 is a magic eight ball. I'm in love with this character already. I really want to play the, right... AR toting mercenary with a magic eight ball. Uh, you also get to learn more specifically what kind of mercenary is it with a D6. Number two, a reformed terrorist with a bomb. Okay, so maybe they used to be up to no good, but now they're trying to help, but they still have a bomb. Always a good idea to give your players a bomb to start the game. Uh, they have special mercenary only gear table. And he also has a HUD helmet, so this would, you know, add some AC, whatever your system uses for armor class. They're wearing it. It's a heads-up display helmet. And their personality, they have a heart of gold. Mercenary with a harmonica, a heart of gold, and a bomb. All right, that's an example of one character. Quick side note, you can use these uh, to generate non-player non characters too, like a, a rival adventuring party or a corpse that they find that has some interesting gear on it or whatever um these the inspiration doesn't isn't limited to only player characters so we'll roll all these delicious troll teeth one more time to do one more character i'll show you you can just roll them all at once and get a, a three we already that was cocked and we already had that two is a scientist scientist with safety glasses the scientist has canned mixed drinks as their coping mechanism. That's what I'm talking about. Gross. Uh, I'm going to call that a six on the D20. Their other gear is a first aid kit. Kind of appropriate for the scientist. They're the healer type. First aid kit with three uses. All right. And what kind of scientist are we talking about? It's number four, the xenobiologist. So if there are aliens around, you'll be the specialist, get some kind of, you know, advantage. And you have a biohazard suit. All the armor type things are underlined, so the biohazard suit would also give some kind of special armor bonus, depending on whatever system you decide to go with. This is a system-neutral deal, so it just gives you general idea, gives you interesting gear that can theoretically be used in any system, uh, and then you plug it in. Plug it in, plug it in, don't sue me. Also a tranquilizer gun with three tranquilizer darts. And personality type four, they're pacifist. You got a, well, okay, yeah, a pacifist xenobiologist who likes his can mix, their can mix drinks. And uh, of course the pacifist is the one with the first aid kit. I love it. So there you have it. Quick couple of dice rolls, less than five minutes, and we got two characters already uh, on the docket. I will add some links to where you can see an adventure I ran with characters generated uh, using this character generator. And as I said, you can pick it up online. Thank you for watching, and have a good life!